Hi friends, uh, very good morning uh, and uh, I am back again with uh, another question answer session. Uh, uh, recently uh, uh, another prospective applicant has asked me this question that what is the cost of living in Canada? So the cost of living in Canada, uh, you know, uh, uh, I, can, I can give you a brief about it, uh, however the detailed answer is available on our blog, uh, on our website, uh, you can search. Uh, our website's blog uh, by typing this question, what is Canada's cost of living and you will find the detailed answer. However, in order to give you a brief uh, answer on this video, uh, the basic costs that are involved are obviously the rent, uh, the place that you live um, and, uh, the, uh, and the vehicle to commute. So these are the two major expenses in Canada. Um, the best part is that all the utilities come along with the rent. Uh, so when you when you rent an apartment, it is the responsibility of the owner to provide you with uh, with the accommodation along with the utilities. Mainly, generally, it is like that. So, like for example, if you rent a basement, uh, uh, generally a basement, a two room basement costs about twelve hundred to fourteen hundred dollars Canadian dollars per month, and it includes the electricity, the heat, the hydro and the water and, uh, and, and city taxes etc and the garbage tax everything is included in that. So hence you don't have to pay for anything else, it's just the rent that you have to pay. Apart from that the second major cost is, is about, uh, about either leasing a car or buying a car. If you buy a second hand car you can easily get a good car, decent car in about five to seven thousand Canadian dollars and the cost of uh, you know maintaining a car uh, the major cost of maintaining a car is the insurance which is about 300 Canadian dollars per month and, uh, and the gas that you have to um, you know uh, fill the car with. <clears throat> so natural, I mean if you lease the car then it would be about 700 to 800 dollars a month but if you buy a car the cost of maintaining a car would be about 500 to 600 Canadian dollars depending upon how many kilometers do you drive in a month. These two are the major costs. Apart from that, um, there are mobile costs, uh, about $50 uh, per person uh, for a month, um, cost for um, uh, going out, having a dinner also costs about $60 for a family. Um, apart from that, there are costs like um, groceries, yeah, so groceries would be would be about depending upon the size of the family it can vary from four hundred dollars to six hundred seven hundred dollars that's what generally the groceries would be and it will include everything which is fruit vegetables other groceries the um, the bathroom supplies and the and the cleaning supplies and the washing supplies everything will be included in that uh, dining out i've already explained uh, if you go out a movie once a month that would cost you about uh, 40 50 uh, 50 to 75 canadian dollars depending upon the size of the family we have talked about the cell phone the internet connection costs about internet and a tv connection costs about 100 canadian some of the uh, owners provide this also along with the the rent uh, but in some cases you have to subscribe for yourself um, gym cost is about 25 to 30 Canadian dollars a month. Uh, so these are the basic costs. Healthcare, if you are permanent residents, healthcare is 100% free. It, uh, there used to be a $75 um, uh, MSP, which is, a, which is called medical services plan uh, fee, uh, which has been waived off uh, from January this year. <clears throat> so hence, healthcare is absolutely free. Your children can go to school without any cost, without any fee. I mean, that's that's a benefit. And apart from that, if you become a permanent residence, government gives you a child benefit, which is called a child care benefit, which comes to tune of 500 to 600 Canadian dollars per child. So if you have two children, uh, you know, the government will pay you about 1200 Canadian dollars per month to take care of your children. So net net, I mean, uh, if you are a family of four, I would say three thousand dollars to three three thousand five hundred dollars. If you if you're maintaining a car, that is what the overall expense would come to. For detailed information, you can visit our website um, uh, on stepwiseimmigrations.com and um, visit uh, the blog section by typing a question. As I said earlier, uh, what is Canada's cost of living, and you will get the answer. 
Thank you for subscribing our channel um, and um, we'll come again with yet another questions uh, with regards to immigration to Canada. If you have any question, you can send us at stepwiseimmigration at gmail.com or info at stepwiseimmigrations.com. We'll be happy to answer. Have a good day.